Yeah, it's Sobo Karaoke Saturday morning. All right, yeah. Why not? All right. Saturday way not again. Far away. Oh, Yeah, so English translation. Why do birds fly away? Why does wind blow away? Why do birds fly away? Why do winds blow blow away? Next lyrics. It's it's a little bit difficult to translate in English. Okay, uh, the Korean language is very different from English. Okay, so that's why I had very difficult time learning English. Okay, it took me a long time. I studied English seven years in K twelve Korean education system. Okay, yeah, I learned grammar, memorized a lot of vocabulary. Uh, but when I first came back to America. In year 1997, 23 years ago, Madison, Wisconsin, okay? It was a whole different story, okay? Because uh, I speak English and they didn't understand what I was saying. And they speak English, I didn't understand what they were saying. Speaking and hearing, okay? That's a whole another story, okay? That was very difficult. Uh, so we have Korean lyrics there, and yeah, now I can, I can memorize. 내 가슴 모두 태워 줄수 있는 건 오직 사랑뿐. Let me try to translate in English, okay? And that's gonna be a challenge. So I have my heart and if I make a product, yeah, I mean, it's very poetic lyrics, but to translate exactly in English, uh, those, the, this poet, poetic spirit will be lost in translation. Okay. So, okay. I have my heart. And I'm going to make this product a gift to you. I have this heart. Burning heart. So I'm going to make something out of my burning heart. And wrap it up in nice wrapping paper and give it to you. As a gift. I will make a product, gift for you out of my burning heart and that's love and that's the only thing I can give you because I got no money okay so it, that's kind of rough approximate translation of that lyrics only love love is the only thing the only thing I can give you because I got no money huh that's kind of translation of that okay <clears throat> I tried, okay, so yeah.
내 가슴 모두 태워 줄수 있는 건 오직 사랑뿐 Let me try once, one, once again 내 가슴 모두 태워 줄수 있는 건 If there is a thing that I can make out of my burning heart Yeah It will be love Better? Yeah. Yeah. If there is something I can make out of my burning heart, it's my love for you. Alright? Is, is it beautiful? Yeah. Very. So in Alaska, we have bumblebees. We don't have honeybees. I mean, honeybees, yeah, it's imported. The people who make honeybees, right? Yeah, it's imported. We, so honeybees, they are not native to Alaska, okay? Because it's just too cold for well, honeybees to win, winter, all right? But we have bumblebees. They live under the ground, right? Yeah. And we have some other bees too. Like sweat bees, it's like a... We are, yeah, we are bumblebees, and I was surprised to learn that bumblebees, they make honey too. It's just, they don't make as much honey as honeybees, okay? But bumblebees, they do make honey. That's what I recently learned. And they're so cute, right? Bumblebees. Bees in general, they are very beautiful. It's like they are wearing sunglasses, right? Beautiful, these eyes and... Also, dragonflies and butterflies, extremely beautiful, right? Their eyes. The eyes of these big butterflies, they're like wearing sunglasses, right? And they're extremely beautiful. Like pilots, right? They fly, right? Yeah. And in Alaska, we have owls. I've seen Alaskan owls. They are, when they fly, they are so silent and they are maneuvering. Oh my goodness, they're so agile and elegant. No sound. And they fly at night. Nocturnal. Bird of prey. Owls. They're so beautiful. They have really big eyes, right? <laughs> yeah. Believe it or not, some Asians, they have big eyes, okay? Me? I'm just average Asian, okay? So I don't, I'm not that handsome. My eyes, not that big, right? But when I was a young kid, I was very cute. I was kind of famous for that. So my mom's friends, they really loved me, okay? When I was like five years old child, because I was really cute. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm just average Asian, all right? Just average. But every now and then, kind and generous people of all different races, uh, they give me compliment saying I'm handsome, okay? I'm like, oh, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I'm kind of insecure about my looks, okay? My looks and feels. I'm kind of, yeah, I'm kind of like a girl, okay? I'm very insecure about the way I look, okay? So, yeah. Let's take five minutes, okay? I'm going to sing you another song by Mr. Pyeonjin Seok, okay? That's a very famous song, okay? And that I, I can find lyrics in the web. I don't have to go to YouTube, okay? So, because that's a very famous song, okay? So, I, I'll sing that song for you and also translate to you, okay? After five minutes. Uh, what's the title in English? Well, what's the title in Korean? Himangsang, okay? In English, wish list.
There it is. Okay. We'll take five minutes, okay? I, I sing this song. So. Yeah, I'm just buying my time before I go to political meeting this morning. Right? Yeah. Okay. Hey, I love American songs too, okay? But today we are having Korean karaoke, okay? Yeah. Why? I just feel like it, okay? I, very much of me is Korean. Yeah, I'm Korean American, okay? I love American songs. Yeah, we'll sing American songs some other time, okay? Yeah, do I eat kimchi? Yeah, I, I eat kimchi. Okay. You want me to sing American song? Alright, let's do it. Alright. Yeah, wish list? Yeah, we'll sing this later. Let's do some American song. How about some dream theme? No, no, no. How about some Beatles? Well, Beatles, they're kind of British, right? Yeah. How about Jet Airliner, the No. You tell me what what kind of song do you want me to sing? Some American song in English. That does not require any translation, okay? <sighs> What's Tess Kent? Dream of you. Again, it may be remake, re-rendition, re I'm not sure. All I do is dream of you.
Okay, Michael Bublé, he, he sang that. Also, Stacey Kent, she sang that. Uh, Michael Bublé, he's cool. Yeah, okay. Uh, my favorite one and only, because Michael Bublé, he's cool, but I like one of his songs, okay? Uh, what's the lyric? I mean, what's the name of that song? I think it means it's like everything. Isn't it beautiful? The title of this song is Everything. It's such a beautiful lyrics and beautiful title. I don't know how to sing this song, okay? But he sang it in such a beautiful way. Because my objection to Michael Bublé is he's kind of Frank Sinatra copycat. Okay, many of his, the kind of jazzy song he sing, his singing style is Canadian American, I guess, but he sounds too much like Frank Sinatra. But this song, everything, that's Michael Bublé himself. Okay, so yeah, very authentic and original. Okay, you are a falling star. You are the getaway car. It goes like that. And in this crazy life, and through the cra these crazy times, it's you, you make me sing. You every line, you every word, you every everything. I like that part. But I, I, I don't know how to sing this song. This is beautiful song. But yeah, stage can't. Uh, all I do is dream of you. She's kind of jazzy kind of singer too, vocalist. Uh, but I don't like her hairstyle. It's too short. Okay. But... Her singing voice is amazing. I like her rendition, okay? Uh, this uh, electric guitar, I think. Then drum. All I do is dream of you the whole night through. <coughs> With the dawn, I still go on and dream of you. You every thought, you everything, you every song I ever sing. Summer, winter, autumn, and spring, yeah. And more than 24 hours a day. They be spent in sweet content, dreaming away. When skies are gray, when skies are blue. Morning, noon, and night time too. All I do the whole day through is dream of you. Yeah. Beautiful song. Yeah. Maybe I go to karaoke bar tonight, okay? Uh, We'll see. It's nine o'clock now. Okay. Uh, we'll take five minutes, okay? Yeah. In the cute pop full mushroom. That's so cute. Yeah. Yeah, they're puffy, so they float over this vodka. It's kind of resisting giving out the juice. But they're full of air, right? Yeah. Puffy. 
Oh well. Mushroomy, very fungal. Funky fungal vodka. I mean, I don't get. I'm not gonna get drunk by just licking my fingers. Yeah. Alright, let's take five minutes, okay? What is this? Is this a bug? Oh boy. Yeah, I'm gonna switch out this cup, okay? So, yeah, there's some bugs. Okay. Alright, we'll take uh, like 10 minutes, okay?
Let me look up. Ah, uh, this song. Till there was you. Who wrote this song? I'm Beatles. They re remade that, but. Let's go to Wikipedia because I, I'm not sure who wrote that song. Meredith Wilson? So it's a guy. Okay. There's another very famous American song written by African Americans in uh, Eastern Coast, like New York, New Jersey. Okay, uh, two African American males wrote that song, and it was like remade, remade of all these different recording artists. Okay, I, I I cannot quite pinpoint what song that was. Yeah, this, Mr. Meredith Wilson, he's a white guy. Okay, but. This another song, this really famous. Maybe Natalie Cole sang that song. Let's look it up, okay? So. Also, Linda Ronstadt, she sang that song too, okay? I love you for sentimental reasons. Yeah, that that's written by Afri two African American gentlemen. Okay, back in the days. Okay, how long did I sing you that song? Huh? Yeah, Linda Ronstadt, Natalie Cole, they both sang this song very beautifully, and. Uh, Yeah, it's a good song, okay? Yeah, I love it for sentimental reasons. But I'm not gonna sing that song, okay? Why? We sang enough, alright? So. Let's get back to acting, alright? So, two characters, okay? Or maybe three. Uh, All Alaskan Lady, Voro, and me, candidate for Alaska State Senate. See? Nine days from now. Okay, so. Yeah. Action. Sim. <laughs> So it's all about you, huh? Me? Me, 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 me? Me? No, it's, it's, uh, I... it's, you think it's all about you? That's why I'm not gonna vote for you. Uh, hey, I, I respect, admire your Freedom, your voting right, constitutional right, freedom. So hey, other candidates, you vote for them. I I, I wouldn't 
hold that against you because I would vote for any one of them. Okay, so let me tell you how I'm gonna vote nine days from now. In this ballot, okay, so there are six of us, all right? In this district, Alaska Republican Senate, State Senate, primary candidates, okay? There are six of us, okay? I will vote for all of them except for myself. Why? Because me voting for myself, that's kind of like unethical, immoral a little bit, right? So I'm not going to do that, okay? I will check the boxes of five candidates, all right? But next to my own name, I'll leave it blank. Why? Because they're my friends, okay? All other candidates, I'll vote for any one of them, and I will vote for all of them. So it will be invalid ballot. But, maybe I'll take a picture of that the ballot box, okay? Yeah. Because I appreciate their campaigns and I appreciate their public service. They're great candidates. So you vote for any one of them and not me? Oh, hey, I, I will vote for them. Or I will vote for all of them, actually, okay? except for myself. So no, my campaign is not all about me. I don't think so. I have to respectfully disagree with you. Sin, cut, okay? All right. Yeah. Yeah. Action. Uh, if I may, may I continue? No! Stop talking! Okay! Yeah, talk! Because if you're silent, I'm bored. Uh, yeah, I want to see you perform. Oh, thank you! If you want to continue to see my performance, Perhaps you want to vote for me. Why? Because I co continue to campaign until general election in November, okay? But if you don't vote for me, and if I lose this primary nine days from today, then my campaign will stop. And I crawl back to my closet and do some mathematics. But there will be no more public appearance for two years. Why? Uh, come 2022, I will run for United States Senate, all right? Whether I win or lose in, in this election, okay? I'll run. So if you don't vote for me, I lose this election, and then, when, then I say, uh, see you in two years, okay? But if you continue to see me perform, if you want to be entertained, because nobody can entertain like I do, I can, okay? I'm very good performer. I'm the best actor, best comedian, best writer, best... If not, I don't think I'm the best lawyer though, all right? I'm decent at it, but when it comes to writing, well, I'm not the best dancer, best singer, but when I sing and dance, I can entertain people like nobody else can. Right? If you continue to see me perform out there in public, then vote for me. Yeah, I continue my campaign. Okay, And if I get elected in November, uh, then you see me on televisions. You see me in interviews. You get to see me a lot. Right? If that's what you want, you want to get entertained, then please feel free to vote for me. Then I'll be around. But otherwise, I crawl back to my closet and study mathematics. If I lose this election, okay. I have no problem with that. Yeah, so it's up to you. I'm all ears. I'm all yours. Okay, it's about you. It's not about me. 
Oh, me? I'm just here to entertain you. I'm a performer, actor, comedian, joker, smoker, drinker, midnight talker, okay? So I'm here to make you happy. Don't you want to be happy? Don't you want to be entertained? Don't you want your children and your grandchildren to be better than you? And I can make that happen. Why? Uh, because, I mean, Alaskans are great, but if I'm the president of the United States, and people in the world, they are doing something wrong. Okay? Uh, they don't eat healthy. They don't do exercise. Okay? And too many Americans, they don't exercise and they don't eat healthy. Okay? And I don't want their children, their grandchildren, to do the same wrong things like unhealthy diet and lack of exercise so i can put a stop on that inheritance of evil bad habits i can put a stop i can disconnect so americans you have kids you have grandkids right i want them to be better than you I want your children, grandchildren, to do exercise and diet. I can teach them. No law, no, just lead by example. Yeah, I can lead by example. Because that's what I do. I eat healthy and I do regular exercise. You Americans, if you vote for me as president of the United States, then I will make your children and your grandchildren better than you. Be going better than you. Okay? I will make them survive and thrive. I will make them succeed. And I'll make you happy. Okay? Sounds like a plan? Then vote for me. Okay? Yeah, I'm still running for president. Okay? Right. We'll take five minutes, okay? Political fantasy. Political fantasy, right? Yeah. <coughs> uh.
Okay, I'm gonna sing you one more song and then we'll wrap it up, okay? It's about time uh, to get ready for the political meeting, meaning <coughs> have my breakfast and take a bath, suit and tie, nice shoes. Yeah. Yeah, it's nine days left, okay? Uh, Unless I get elected, it is primary, then I continue the campaigning, okay? No problem, all right? So if I win primary, I think I might win, okay? I don't know. There's no way to tell, all right? And yesterday, the cooking competition, where I lost because I didn't cook. Hello. But, yeah, I don't think that's... Poll. I don't think that constitutes a poll, right? I don't think so. That's not some election poll. No, I don't think so. So, yeah. I think I might win, okay? Nine days from now. Yeah. I'm gonna sing another song, okay? And then we'll wrap it up for today. I mean, this episode, okay? Yeah, I'll be back in the evening, okay? So, or in the afternoon, whatever. Two back to back political meetings, okay? So, how are Evoli Brothers? Dream. Lyrics. It's a love song, right? Back in uh, back in the era where television is black and white, gray, okay? Yeah, like 1950s, 60s, something like that, okay? Yeah. Dream, 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 when I want you in my arms, when I want you and all your charms, Whenever I want you, all I have to do is dream. When I feel blue in the night and I need you to hold me tight, do I have to do is dream. I can make you mine, taste your lips of wine, anytime, night or day. Only trouble is dreaming. I'm dreaming my life away. I need you so that I could die. I love you so, and that is why whenever I want you, I have to dream. Yeah, it, it, they rhyme so well, right? It's a beautiful song. Good rhyming. Alright, uh, well, I gotta fill my bathtub with hot water, okay, so we may have like five more minutes, okay? Right. Beautiful song. Let's rehearse, all right? So I go to a political meeting, like two hours from now. Uh, probably they give us like three minutes to, to uh, candidates, okay? Three minutes, I think. Probably they give us that, okay? So, yeah. Let's take five minutes, okay? And then with court's indulgence, you are the court, you are the judges. Yeah, judge me, by all means. 
you're the voters, right? Yeah. But what's my crime? Wanting to be a politician, I guess. Oh, there's crime, there's like felony. You are running for an office? You, are po you want to be a politician? What's wrong with you? You want to be a politician? What's wrong with you? Oh, there's federal crime, that's like felony. That, Yeah, so you be the judge. Okay? The only crime I committed is I'm running for an office. I want, yes, I want to be a politician. Yes, I love politics. How about this? The only crime I committed is that, uh, the, the only thing I'm guilty of is I'm um, Republican. I'm conservative. That's the only thing I'm guilty of. Yeah, I'm Christian too. Yeah, I'm very guilty of that. Huh? That's the only sin I have ever committed in my life. And if you call it a sin, I continue to commit this sin. Being a Republican, being a conservative, being a Christian. And if it is a crime to exercise my constitutional right of freedom of speech, if it is a crime, to be an American. I have to continue to comment that soon, okay? Because I love being conservative, Republican, Christian, American, and I love being an Alaskan, right? So, would I ever leave Alaska? And go down to Law 48 one day? We take five minutes, okay? And I, I will answer that question. Okay? Give me five minutes. Yeah, political re speech rehearsal, I don't need it, okay? By now, <laughs> I'm very good at it, so yeah, I don't need rehearsal. Yeah, so will I ever leave Alaska? We'll talk about that, okay? Give me five minutes. Yeah, my best top is filling with hot water, so it will take probably five more minutes, okay? So, yeah. Okay, so we are able to leave Alaska.
イエス王の。Yes, if I become the president of the United States. Until then, I will never leave Alaska. If I become the president of the United States, yeah, I go to Washington DC, White House. After that, will I come back to Alaska? I will do only one term. If I get elected as president of the United States, I will do only one term. Four years, that's it. Then, will I come back to Alaska? Uh, that I cannot tell. Why? After four years as president of the United States, uh, what would I do next? I want to be a professor in a university. Okay. In Alaska, yeah, we have fantastic universities, right? University of Alaska, so really. Fairbanks, Anchorage, or they're great schools. Okay. So I applied to different universities, but. Yeah, in Alaska and in other states. But if this college campus is smoke free, if I cannot smoke cigarettes, then that's a no go. Okay, because I need cigarettes. Alright? So I apply to become a professor as an ex president of the United States. I apply to different universities uh, to become a professor. What would I be teaching? What else? Humanology. Okay. So it's, it will be one man department. Okay, department of humanology will be just me. Okay. So I apply to university to become a professor. And if they have the smoke free campus, if I cannot smoke cigarettes, then that's a no go. Okay, so. Yeah, so that's the plan. Okay, my preference is Alaska. I, yeah, I want to come back to Alaska, okay, if, after I do my four years in the White House. But I, I will apply and then if I cannot smoke cigarettes in the campus, then I can't be a professor there or here, okay. Well, my preference is Alaska because I love Alaska, okay. So that's the plan and that's my fantasy daydream. All right, so there's that. Okay. All right. I uh, will see you later. Thank you. Bye. Have a nice, great and safe weekend.